Now the last thing that needs to be done, well not the last thing, I gotta put the coil back in there. Um, maybe I'm gonna clean this a little bit and then I'm gonna put it in that hole. hole. And you guys know then the, the boot gets clamped on. Uh, this one I took off, I was analyzing it. I was gonna put some dielectric, dielectric grease on it. Um, inside, you know, nothing touching the metal components. Oh, that's blurry. I don't like it when it's blurry. There we go. Um, yeah, so I was going to put it around, but I didn't know how to work the damn thing. I didn't know how to open the bottle. Uh, it's a weird thing. But anyways, um, I think I'm going to clean this a little bit. Uh, just because I want to clean it up. And then I'm going to put this boot in there and then, I'm sorry, put this coil in there and then plug the boot in. So that will be that. I actually got the spark, the rear spark plugs changed. Oh my gosh. Um, and I do have to change the gasket. So I need some uh, special, um, I think, kind of tools to get these out here. Cause these are rubber I tried to use pliers and I broke a little bit of the tip off there so that's not gonna be wise to try to do that um, I got these bolts off as you can see uh, so it's the matter of getting these off these little suckers gotta get those off and then I also have to change the valve cover gasket um, that'll be another video, but anyways, uh, I'm gonna put this in and complete it. I would put the camera, but I need both of my hands, but you get the idea. All right, bye.